The map symbol plotting options include five major types that are non-exclusive to each other. For example, it is possible to plot both uniform symbols and circles within the same map. This video will describe each of these options. The uniform option will plot the same symbol at each XY location. To change the symbol, click on the symbol icon. The uniform option will plot all of the symbols at the same size. This size represents a percentage of the map size. To vary the size based on a data column, select the variable option. Specify which data column will determine the symbol size. The linear option will multiply the column value by the multiplier to determine the symbol size. The range option will normalize the data within the designated data column such that the smallest data column value will be sized at the minimum setting while the largest value will be sized at the maximum setting. To use the column based option, a data sheet column must be set up as a symbol column. If all the symbols are to be plotted at the same size, select the uniform option and set the size which represents a percentage of the project size. To plot the symbols at different sizes, select the variable option and specify the data column that will determine the size. The linear option will multiply the values within the designated column by the multiplier to determine the symbol size. The range option will normalize all of the values within the designated data column such that the lowest value is plotted at a size equal to the minimum value while the highest value will be plotted at a size equal to the maximum. Select the circles option to plot circles at the XY locations. The dimensions uniform option will plot uniformly sized circles at the specified size which is expressed as a percentage of the project size. The variable option will size the circles based on a value within the designated data sheet column. The linear option will multiply the designated data column values by the specified multiplier to determine the radius of each circle as a percentage of the project size. The range option will normalize all of the values within the designated data column such that the lowest value is plotted at a radius equal to the minimum while the highest value will be plotted at a radius equal to the maximum. The color monochrome option is used to plot all of the circles using the same specified color. The color variable option is used to assign circle colors based on a designated color column within the data sheet. The fill style is used to determine if the circles will be filled or hollow. Hollow circles should be considered when plotting the circles in conjunction with other types of symbols such as column based symbols. The table based option will read the values from a designated column and look them up in a custom range table to determine the symbol size, type and color. The range table consists of rows and columns that define a minimum and maximum filter and an associated symbol and size. For example, if the value within the designated data sheet Z column is 125.6, the program will pick a pink polygon at a size of 2.0% of the project size. Finally, if the data sheet contains a column with an image name, the images option can be used to plot images at the XY locations.